Hey, Jen, you want to dance? Uh, this isn't Studio 54. This uh, is West Hall. What are you kids doing now? We were going to dance. <laughs> you see what I'm up against here? That's why I got the stress ball at that other video that you saw. Anyway, Chris. Jen. And Bill. And we're the Bobbleheads, covering the 2023 California Spring Trials, this time at the Green Fuse facility here in beautiful Somis, California, specifically looking at Westhoff, a German breeding company known for, well, gosh, some of the craziest petunias you might ever want to see. There's a crazy petunia back there. They're everywhere. There's Let's crazy look at a petunia right here. Let's look at these crazy petunias. Right, but these well, aren't crazy petunias. These are disco ball petunias, their newest introduction in a series. Uh, it's pretty easy to tell why they named this. Uh, first off, the ball shape, which seems to be pretty popular in petunias right now, but what about the disco portion of it? Well, the disco comes from the crazy spotting on these petunias. There are, right now, they have violet, purple, and pink. They said there are plenty more coming. These are gonna look really nice in quartz because of that ball shape mounted habit. Right. And we were told this is a cross with two different parents, and one of the parents being their compact petunia. Yeah, so we've seen this is going to become a more popular type of pattern yep. um, from more breeding companies. Uh -huh. This is their own breeding. Now, back to the crazy tunias. Some of them, just every year they introduce cool new colors. This one is called Ginger Snap. I love that color. That's I, absolutely one of the nicest colors yes. we've seen in the last few days. I don't even know if it can be described by what the camera is picking up. I'm not sure the sensor is powerful enough, but it's orange and burgundy, I would say. So, and if, Osvaldo, if you come back this way, here's um, one more new one that's really worth seeing. This one's called Cosmic Violet, and it's another one that's, gosh, it's really hard to describe. It's just deep, deep purple with really cool edging on it, and it's actually a sport out of black like mamba. mamba. Mm -hmm. Now, they do other things besides petunias, for instance, Calibracoa. Jen, this looks like a really neat Calibracoa for fall. It does. And it's called Cappuccino. It has the standard uh, medium habit, kind of trailing, mounding, but it's also a day length neutral, very nice color. What do you think? Do you like it? Yeah, I actually do. And it looks really good in combos. I saw them at Costa and I know they've been experimenting with uh, different uh, plants to kind of correspond with these. Here's something you haven't seen. Oh. How about a variegated Calibracoa? Isn't that, my mom would have called that cunning. That means tiny and cute. Uh, now, here's the thing. You don't put much chlorophyll in the leaf. You're gonna have a compact, sort of a low big, vigor plant. So this one's uh, great for real tiny gardens. It's called Calico. That's a nice gift. If it's raining, we might need an umbrella, but the petunia behind us doesn't. Why's that, Chris? Well, it's the Flower Shower Series, Young William, and they were bred uh, to be rain resistant. Nice, compact habit. Uh, this is Ringo Star. What a great name for this ringed star pattern on the flower. Uh, there's also a new one next to it called Blue. The whole series was introduced last year, as a matter of fact. And as I understand it, the breeder was selecting for long flower stems so that the plants would have sort of a springy action, like a diving board when the rain hits it. I don't know if that's true or not, but it's flower showers and it's meant to be really tough out in the rain. Lottie Dottie. We likes to party. Oh, good grief. First it's disco, now it's 90s rap references. Well, we can't help it. But in this case it works because this is a new Hypoestes series from Westhoff called Lottie Dotty, and I take it to mean lots of dots because that's what it has. Four different colors in this. They're holding red and rose. And then over here, hold on, let's, let me put this down. There's white and pink. And this is, these are part of the fancy fillers program, which are the foliage varieties that are selected and grown vegetatively so that they mix well with some of the larger vegetative products like petunias, calibracoa, and combos. Right, and all these hypoestes, and I suspect all the fancy fillers are available as URCs. So they're uh, cost efficient to grow and fast for the grower. So that's uh, 
The new introductions here from West Hoff, West Hoff at the 2023 California Spring Trials. Let's go wrap some more 90s. Yeah, sweet. Good grief. <laughs> You're old.